Hey, this is Synergy Loves Company. I'm Eric Hathorne. Tim Burton was a little bit ahead of his time when it came to Disney. In the early 80s, they did let him go because he was a little too dark and creepy. They didn't understand what he was bringing to the table at the time. But before they let him go, in 1982, he made this love letter short to Vincent Price called Vincent. He even got Vincent Price to do the narration. On this video, I'm going to talk to Mike Ross from the Rear Cuts Media Society all about the short. Take a look. It's interesting. Actually, we're going to get into a realm where he does a lot of voice work for for Disney right now. Um, and it, it kind of comes in the in the early 80s here. Uh, and I think we could thank Tim Burton um, for basically all of this. Uh, this is where, where Vincent Price and Disney are going to come together. And we're actually going to get some Vincent Price working on Disney pro uh, projects. And I'm really going to say it's all... Uh, thanks to Tim Burton. Now, before we get in there, there's going to be some spots where we will talk about Tim Burton, but I think, Mike, I'm going to have to have you come on another time <laughs> to just talk about Tim Burton, because that could be maybe like three shows of just talking about Disney <laughs> and Tim Burton, because there's so much history back there, some of it not yeah. so nice. Um, but we'll, that we'll, we'll save some Tim Burton for the other day, but we do have to dabble into his story a little bit here. Um, so I think the best well, place to... Yeah, yeah. Just just a segue into this. Um, sure. You know, at the time, Tim Burton, at the beginning of the 80s, he's he's helping out and as an animator for, like, Fox and the Hound. He's working on that type of feature. So he's he's known, and so, yeah, I think that he probably would have some clout with being able to pull, uh, pull some people, especially, like, Vincent Price, who was an icon to him. For sure. And I think you saying that... It, uh, Vincent Price was an icon to him is perfect for talking about Vincent. Um, the the Tim Burton uh, is it stop motion animation? I'm sure it is. Yeah, nice. Um, and so it it's I I kind of feel I kind of feel like Tim Burton wrote the the short about himself, um, <laughs> but it's about a young child who's obsessed with Vincent Price, and then of course Vincent Price is narrating it, and it's totally. Mm -hmm totally tim burton um it just looks tim burton i don't know how yeah. else to describe that like it just looks like nightmare before christmas it looks like all that kind of like you know stripes and swirl kind of thing he does beetlejuice kind of feel um it's mm -hmm. got that tim burton feel uh, yeah, to it even even the poetry i mean because it is it's kind of like a stop motion poetry um Tim Burton has, you know, great interest and in, has written his own books of poetry. So it, it and it feels very similar. And you know, this was the first video take of it, at least the first one that is owned by Disney. <laughs> right, of course. If you like this video, like and subscribe. If you really like this video, visit synergylovescompany.com for the full audio podcast.